Skatosis episode number 188. <laughs> Welcome back, everybody, to another episode of Skatosis. I'm Drew Domkus. And I am Aaron Monty. Oh, Skatosis is the condition of being consumed and obsessed with all things skateboarding. And I got news right off the bat. Tell me your news. What is that? Why your mic sound so low? Does it? Say something. Get in there. I'm in there. I'm in there, dog. All right, I hear it. it there we go. My level up? Yeah. Level up. Level, level up. up. Level up. So. You got last, news. Last episode. Last episode, which was your thirtieth birthday episode, thirtieth birthday. Yeah, remember we talked about that. Man, it'd be interesting to look back a year ago. Yeah. So last year on my birthday, yeah, was season two. Oh, so, so we're starting season three. So, and again, we took a little break in between, <laughs> unintended. Yeah. So welcome, welcome everyone to season three. Yeah, I heard Kelly Hart say something like, uh, "It was I think during mm. was it the experience." They were talking about podcasting and this and that, and he's like, "Well, don't most podcasts do seasons?" I'm like, well, "That is never. That was never the intention when podcasting started. Yeah. Seasons at all. Like nobody was doing anything like that." And I don't even. I don't even think it really was like ten years ago or so. Mm-hmm. Like when I got into podcasts, or like mm-hmm. I mean, probably hasn't even been that long. But like it wasn't really a thing because we didn't. No, everybody was just to, doing their thing. There was no like. It was already episodic. You were doing one whatever long season. Yeah. Yeah. And when we first started, uh-huh. we didn't even have that thought because you didn't really see that. I, yeah, I saw I, like I never, here and there, but. Well, I never, because it always bothered me. Like the bunt does it. They're always doing seasons. I'm like, why yeah. Why even stop? Like, but just don't keep they going. have like crazy seasons where like they're off for like whole winter or something? That's what I'm saying. They totally take breaks. Yeah. That seems a little defeatist to the idea of a podcast because. You could just put stuff off. There's no real rules. Yeah. I mean, unless they got- That's the same thing with, from their point of view. There are no rules. You can do whatever you want. Yeah, So really, sure. I'm not really dissing them. I just don't like that format. And I guess like if there's like a period, if you can like bank them, mm-hmm. and then if there's like a period where you can't be mm-hmm. doing that, if like shit's going on, I get it. It may, Like it helps a lot. And I think it's different if you're actually making, if it's, you're making a living off it. Yeah. If you've got a requirement to do so many and you're getting, like when we first did it, we had a contract to do five a week, but we could mm-hmm. do them all in one day. It didn't matter. Mm-hmm. As long but as you, we had and five you still for the didn't week. do seasons, though. No, no, no. Yeah. It was just one. We're still going. We're still in season yeah. one. I could put an episode out today of the Dawn and Drew show and the feed is there. It'd be episode 1089 or something yeah. like that. You know, we well, went out there. For, for for no reason at all, mm-hmm. super arbitrary. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, this is season three. Yeah, season three. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> I had just posted a picture. I don't know if you saw it, but on the stories, my the Skatosis, oh, the Skatosis podcast stories, I post, put a picture of the awards up there. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I saw somebody just got a, a podcast award, but it was a, a 2020, was it 2020 or? Yeah, 2020 version of the one on the right over there. You should. That I have from 2006. Can you post again and take a picture of yours and Dawn's and just like cross- Don's off <laughs> on it and just write like errands for skatosis. <laughs> it says the Don and Drew show on it. Yeah, just cross yeah. it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we got one in 05, 06, and then in Hall of Fame in 16, I think it says. It was 16 or 17. Hmm. But, when did uh, we start the show? 17? Uh, we started ours. We're in four years in. What are we at? 2021? So 17. Yeah, 17, yeah. I think. I thought it was summer of 17. I think we had already started. I think I wore old do Skateco stuff when I got the Hall of Fame stuff. So we might have been doing Skatosis at the time. I think so. Yeah, and yeah, we yeah. started old dude and Skatosis were yeah, like t- yeah, yeah. It's, there it's all together. It's, yeah. it's a, there's one big handshake. But we like one we big, like started it, it at the under the big poop and fart umbrella. Yeah, I don't like to I don't like to admit to that. <laughs> I don't like to admit my checks are signed with that, but <laughs> you got your Wi-Fi right. <laughs> <laughs> well, now I don't have to see it. It just connects automatically. I know, that's funny. God, uh, technology is so great. You don't even need to think about I shit. I meant to. Well, so here's the season three. Season three, dog. Wait. And you know what? <sighs> just like always, Cheers. mine's already open. I know. I saw that when I first came up here. Whenever, you opened it. When we used to do On the Pew, mm-hmm. we used to crack them together, and mm-hmm. I always opened mine early. 
Yeah, we haven't done on the pew in a long time. Mm-hmm. But um, there's no pew up there anymore. Right. Yeah. So. Well, there's a little. There's a little bit. <laughs> right. The show, that- the show has morphed a little bit here and there, and I love that we're not stressed about putting a show out every week. You know, if somebody wanted to pay us to do a weekly show, that's a different story. But like, I, I week I, we have the capabilities to do it. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. But I like that because it's not, you know, it's not a requirement. I like that we can go three weeks and it's not a big deal. Yeah, for sure. I mean, we had <laughs> to lead into season three as well. We also don't have listeners barking at the door, <laughs> knocking them down. Like, yes. You know, yes. Is that the word? Is that the term? Bark, knocking at, knocking our doors down to get a new episode. <laughs> Or barking you, at the barking I don't know. at the door. I think all of those are wrong. To be honest. I think so too. I was like, "Who's barking at the door?" <laughs> I think you're thinking of the three pigs. Hmm. Who's grinding our curb to yeah. get a new show? Yeah, that's the better one. Yeah, we don't know. <laughs> grinding our curb. Yeah, don't grind my curb. <laughs> don't grind my curb. That's like uh uh fuck. Uh, I'll think of it. Yeah. Uh, grind my gears. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Don't grind yeah, my curb. Exactly. Don't, don't grind, mock no, my. Don't yum. grind my gears, please. Grind my curb. Oh, you want him to grind the yeah, curb? Actually, yeah, actually, I do. Yeah, curves are good. We're made for grinding. All right, we take it back. Yeah, get it, in there. I take it all back. It's all wrong. I do always, I do always like the phrase when I see new skaters out. Okay, where they're like timid to drop in or something. Yeah, I love the phrase that I learned years ago: "Get in where you fit in." Get in. You just got to fit in. You just got to drop in and just like so like charge the shit. That's perfect, actually, because especially here at the ramp, like there's so many levels. No, but not everybody's dropping in. At the same place. Yeah. Get in where you fit in. Get in where you fit in. I love telling people that. It. And if you're not ready to drop in, push to the quarter. Yeah. There you go. Or like, or like just kick turn on the court. There's so many levels There's of so skating. Many, for sure. I and remember it, um, when I did a lot of vert skating, a lot of times I would just start at the bottom and mm-hmm. you'd kind of go, I'd hold the tail. I'd run up the wall, put my front foot on the board and then just pump into it. Like and, they do, like if you're skating a full pipe. Yeah, same yeah. kind of. Th- I remember starting a lot of times that way. If you didn't want to drop in, or at least like when you first get there, if you don't want to climb up there or run up there, because uh-huh. the ramp that we skated a lot was just a couple of blocks away. This kid had it in his in his backyard, tight in the yard, and his dad built it for him. It was like twelve foot tall, foot of vert, and we would just charge that thing all the time after school. I remember God, twelve foot tall. It was so big, crazy. man. It was a big ramp. Did you ever skate a ramp as a kid that had stairs? That one. We well, it had a ladder or something. You had to get. You know, it yeah. definitely had a way to climb up, but. The very first time, if you just you could pump your way up, sure. You know. I like doing that on the vert at Jabasso. Mm-hmm. I haven't dropped in on it, of course, but just like pumping and like getting close to coping is mm-hmm. so. F- I know we did that too in Kentucky with that ram. Yeah, which you gotta. It's crazy that I've tried that ramp, yeah, and, and I haven't you even, haven't been back for it. Well, it didn't exist, remember? It wasn't yeah, there. Yeah, and then a year later, it was. It was, yeah, but it was literally not there, just the footprint of it. I remember the during that time, too, we went to Kentucky. Was that 2017, too? I think it was. 2017, it's, it's, and then I went 2018 with Surf. Yeah, it's possible. I mean, we did do it early. And I remember thinking in 2018, uh, I'm going to now go, and Joe was like, this is stupid, I'm going to go to Kentucky uh-huh. every year just because what a dumb thing to, like, Kentucky of all places. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm like, I've just gone twice in two years. I might as well, just, and that, well, it's, gonna, it's 2021 now, so that be, didn't happen. It's going to be Iowa now with Des Moines opening up. Yeah, dog. Yeah, and I, that seems, I think we got to look at the map, it seems a little closer. I but think it man, might be brand new, fresh concrete. Like yeah. I think largest park in the country. I think so. And one, the one and only Olympic qualifier this year. Yeah, dude. So I'm hyped That's to, wild. Like, to see all the pros that are in that whole world. Like Nija, man, to go see him again in person like that. Should here's a question for you: cool. Should they be doing the Olympics? Yeah, why not? <laughs> COVID. You're, Mr., you're Mr. Paranoid. I am, but like. Yeah, but there's so many things that can happen with everybody doing all these ultra precautions. The people that are dying mostly, I mean, I, mean, we, can, I don't want to get detailed into what's like really happening. But yeah. like, but also no like to... Nija had a super spreader party, right? So like, yeah, but some people are that, dumb. Right. But make that times, how many people are at the Olympics? Dude, I don't know. I don't 500,000? I don't want to live scared, man. Life's too short as it <sighs> is. Like you get, get hit by a bus, dude, tomorrow. Yeah, but there's and you're Again, va- and you're vaccinated. I, <laughs> so what are you even worried about? I am. I don't. I don't want other people to get sick and die. Well, that's their problem. Yeah, but <laughs> but as in, an dude, impact, I in, can't. Where you get in? 
But where I fit in <laughs> is a uh, mentality of being sad always. Well, change that, man. Turn your frown upside down, homeboy. Oh, it's hard. It's wow. hard. Being an empath is so, I'm like, it's like a narcissistic mm-hmm. empath where I'm like, it's so hard caring so much about other people. <laughs> NFL had a full season. Yeah. They pulled it off. Yeah. I mean, uh, I, I also said too, they probably, every game I'm like, <laughs> probably shouldn't be doing this. As you're like, go, fo- go for Yeah. Us. I'm like, <laughs> I'm watching every game and I'm like, mm, I don't know. You totally sat on my joke. I said, go Favre. Oh. <laughs> Honestly, I thought you said go fart. Go fart. That's, that's why I moved past it. <laughs> uh, oh, that's that's funny. funny. Yeah. <laughs> Didn't, wasn't there something with Favre recently? Yeah, he's been on some podcasts talking about his painkiller addiction and this and the other. And yeah. He's out there. He does some podcasts. Yeah. He's a fun guy to listen to. He's got a he's got a funny sense of humor and uh, that, that southern twang, that... Louisiana twang. Yeah. And he never lost coming to Wisconsin. No. That, I, I would imagine that's a Speaking tough one. Speaking of, lose. and this is a different podcast, but yeah, Aaron, no, Jones, what are we talking about? Aaron Jones got re signed. I saw that. That's is he tight. a skater? <laughs> this is a skatosis. You know, who is that skater? <laughs> there is a football playing skater for sure. I saw him at Manny Santiago's is Park. Cali? Oh, uh, I just saw I it. I don't recently. remember that dude's name, but yeah. he's been at the barracks too. Yeah. Oh, I've I've definitely seen him. Yeah, he had a whole like uh, and, um, little story on him at the barracks. Not football, but Hopkins. Yeah, what Hopskin, does he do? He's a rapper. Oh, that's right, rapper yeah. skater. Yeah, his is cool though. He hasn't done a bunch because of COVID and mm-hmm. like whatever. Uh, his is cool too that he like gets a pro. Yeah, and learn and a new he, trick. Yeah, I and like he's that. like he's like, hey, what's your trick? You like? I'm I, gonna try that. I saw Nick Tucker teach him inward heel. Yeah, because he's got a bunch of tricks down already for sure. Yeah. And then he's like, let's let's get at it. I, Maybe yeah, the best that's a good skating series. rapper. Oh, that's a tough one. I can't Lil, really think of Lil Wayne. <laughs> I mean, Lil yeah. Wayne is he? He's got some moves. Yeah. Justin Bieber is not a rapper, right? He's a singer. no. I don't know if he's really a skater either. Uh, who else raps? Remember when he fell? Remember uh, that clip what about, of him falling down the stairs? What Nikel? He raps. Oh, that's true. Oh, and Jordan, I guess like rapper to skater. They're more mm-hmm. skater to rapper. But Jordan Maxim too has put out some shit. Yeah, but how do you know that those rappers, like you, who's what's his name? Um, Nikel? No, no, no. The guy with the show. Hopskin. Hopskin. Maybe he skated as a kid before he ever rapped. Yeah, mm-hmm. that could be. Hey. <laughs> hey, I'm, I'm giving it to you. <laughs> oh, man. So, dude, awesome time today. Yeah. It's a Saturday. It's a little rainy. It's not our typical Sunday sesh, but... You came out and we hit the barn. Yeah. It's been a long time since we skated the barn. I haven't been in there since November. Right? It's been a long time. Yeah. And a year ago today, well, a year ago, I'm starting to get these Was memories. season two. Yeah. On season <laughs> two, when um, all these memories are starting to come up on Facebook of me on my attempts to land my first kickflip. Yeah, so I'm coming up on a year of that, which is this like was a year of COVID. It's so been like, a year of COVID, yeah. This is when we kind of went to like Instagram Live, yeah, or like Instagram chats. Yeah. But so now it's uh, we're 2021. It's spring. I'm back upstairs. We're in the studio. We're skating I'm the barn. Fully vaccinated. It's like things are kind of coming back to life. Mm-hmm. I still don't ever see people. I live out in the boonies, yeah. so like things haven't changed for me. Yeah. So awesome. Yeah. But uh, today sure. was great. But what was really cool is that. Um, I don't know if we even talked about it last show. I'm not positive. I know I posted a picture of it. I think you got it in between last I show. Think, I think so too. But so I got hit up by a guy in uh, Nina, which is up about an hour away from here. And I can't exactly recall if we've met in person, but I know him online. And it's like he knows it's like he's the Fox Valley guy, but I might have seen him at Cream City, blah, blah, blah. Hits me up if I want two curbs. Two fat uh, ones. And I'm like, yes, thank you. Yeah. And I'm like, when and where? You know, <laughs> and I just happened to be going up to Appleton that next day to a mm-hmm. gem show. How did you I feel get like we him talked about this? In oh, you think so? How did know. you get him in the car Dude, that day? I'm so thankful Caden was with me. Uh-huh. He's a big person. Uh-huh. But he does not lifted big things, but he helped me just kind of get him in the car. I had uh I had taken out the back seats of the element. I put a, a blanket and then a tarp. And then I had some because they're like heavy duty curves. Dude, they're like 150 pounds. Yeah, because they're like five and a half foot. They're, yeah, and they're solid. And uh, two of them, I got them up in the car. The element's awesome. I had to like sit way up on the wheel because uh-huh. like they were up against it's the back seat. Up on you, yeah. But um, yeah. So they're outside. You know, they've been outside, 
and uh, brought one in today and just wanted to play around with it. We've got, I've got a curb like that here already, but it's chewed up. A yeah. lot of chunks in it, hard to skate smooth. You know, it's just it's not that good to learn mm-hmm. on a curb. And so, um, yeah, I just had a bunch of fun on it today. I've got a bunch of tricks on it. A mm-hmm. bunch of, uh, um, what did I do? Well, you, call, you would call it a shotgun. Like when you go straight up yeah, and over something. If that, is that shotgun or is that? Um, I thought it was just like up and over, or like head on or something. I'm pretty sure it is shotgun, but I've also heard the rails that are a rail and then like a rail next to it. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Like real close. Yeah. I've heard that called shotgun before too. Huh. Because of double barrel. Yeah, I think that so. That would make more but sense. But I think like straight, I think that's where the shotgun thing, straight on. Yeah. It's like looking right down yeah, into it. Yeah, because if it's like a rail, sometimes the guy will like, or girl, will wally up the front of it and then do a trick down it. Like yeah. Mason's done that a Ma- bunch of yeah. times. Yeah, yep. That one rail in I'm not, Sacramento, I think I'm it is. I'm not trying to relate myself to Mason with my little curb bump, because <laughs> this is like good size curb. Uh-huh. But that that bonk right on the edge of it, it's got a bit of an angle. It's not straight up or square. It's just got a. T- I don't know what that angle is. It's probably like a, well, it, it seems fo- like a like leg- thirty degree angle, maybe. Yeah, it seems like like a legit curb. Oh, they are for sure. Yeah, like if you saw, this is I don't what, think it's anything like crazy, like wally no. on the ends. It's just not straight. It's not a ninety degree. Yeah, it's got a little bit of an angle in, so yeah. it's got a nice that you can wally up real easy. So I, I don't know. It bonked into. 50 i bonked into 50 mm-hmm. uh i got a bunch of grinds some slides and then i started doing the walk the uh like a no comply wally so like you're a, going right what do you think your make of the day is oh man it has to be i was trying to think because i landed a bunch of variations of the no comply bonk mm-hmm. i got up and did i did a no comply kind of like 50 and then out front side i did a no comply bonk I think I landed one without my hands, but then I started doing a bunch of nose grab bonks. I never, I don't know, even know if I've seen anybody do that. I no comply, bonked off the end, caught it with my my left hand, my leading hand, and then I came down on the tail. I came, I kind of scraped. I came, I came off of it and just did like a caveman. It felt like it's a little bit of like an air walk in a way. A little bit. It's weird. Yeah. If I landed like down on the tail, your feet don't like, kick out so much. But a, it's almost a Madonna. If I landed on the tail. Yeah, if, yeah. If your but your foot would have to stay on the tail. It would this have one to, right, like right. both feet are kind of coming off. I right? love watching like Sebo does it a lot. Wes Kramer does it, but just that like uh, no comply bonk flip, just up and over a curb. Mm-hmm. It's very similar to that. I love the way that looks, and I want to learn something like that. But this was kind of going on the long end. I was hitting the end, bonking, catching in my hand, dude. And it was like it felt so great. Yeah, like I was just catching it, and then I just jumped. And wherever I landed, <laughs> whatever uh-huh. the board let me do, and a couple of times it hit the you know tail or a brand new sensation. Yeah, it's re- it's it was fun. It was really cool. So I'd have to say one of those is my make of the day. Probably one of them. I scraped the tail. That felt really good. Mm-hmm. I did a line. I did a bonk nose grab, and then like caveman out, and then I did a little fifty on the next curve, and then a shove. So that was kind of like oh, that was fun. I yeah, don't know if that would be the I don't, one of those has got to be the make of the day. I can't believe we, when I pulled up, I can't believe we skated the curbs Mm -hmm. because when I pulled up, it was like downpouring. Yeah. And then probably what, half an hour later, it was over? Yeah, I calmed down. We were right at the tail end of the storm, which was nice. So, yeah. Ramp was getting just a couple of drops, but yeah, that curb was fun. Yeah. Um, you were trying a few things, but you were you were having a hard time. It was a hard day. You had some board slide shove it. So, I remember seeing. Board slide at the very beginning. Think, yeah, yeah I think, shove. and like I get, I'm not even gonna give a make of the day. <laughs> no, <laughs> but I threw a half cap board slide shove, and yeah. that's what I was like. That's usually like a go to, like after the half cap board, mm-hmm. and like just took too long to like even yeah. counter to make of the day. I was struggling with the half cap board. That was yeah, it was not computing. Like I know I'll get it. I was just so nervous of washing out. Yeah, like just. Like I wasn't popping. I just kept like turning and maybe the nose would hit or something. But like, I don't know. See, you were like steering away from yeah, it though. I don't know. It was so weird coming. In. It's of course coming in fakey for some. It just freaks me out. I have yeah. a feeling because when I did fall as a kid and I ripped my finger and like dislocated that knuckle and I got those stitches, I was going fakey on a launch ramp. Uh-huh. And I think that's just in my mind. That's it's just an been aversion like, it, for it, the it, rest it, of your life. It is, man. It's yeah. really kind of thrown me. It's a, a bummer. Mm-hmm. It's the same. It's me. Years ago, when me and Joe first knew each other, mm-hmm. and one night we got fucked up on <laughs> vodka, 
cranberry juice and I think maybe grenadine or orange juice or something like that. And those ingredients now, I can never drink again. If you give me like something with vodka and cranberry, I'm yeah. like, take this away. <laughs> that aversion will be with me for. We got. Well, here, I got a picture of it right here. Hang oh, on. God. <laughs> I'm telling you, we got so fucked up. We were like at a point, you know, and I've done this here too, where you get to the point where you're making drinks where it's like a splash of the other thing. Yeah. You're like filling up the cup and then a splash. Yeah. yeah. So it was just too much. <laughs> Oh, I think that that too that story after that that was when I went into like that sobriety thing of like like I didn't yeah, drink, you at didn't all drink for, for a while for like six months I remember. eight months yeah I remember that that was that night where it just like yeah, yeah. I'm fucking done <laughs> I know we were just talking like after we started skating before the the podcast was like we're coming up on ten years of like friendship you and it's I. crazy coming up that's pretty wild man like and I guess such like a, half of it a, has been the show. Uh, yeah, Almost, yeah, yeah, at least, and um, it being such like a random happenstance of like you showing up at the barn, like I with know, Brenda was so but it bizarre. just it just goes back to that story of our weird connection mm-hmm. of like when I went to Chicago and then we ended yeah, up we ended meeting up, up like, like, <laughs> like that ran, weird. like that too, like why, uh, why would that even? <laughs> you scared the fuck out of me that day. Yeah, you like came yeah, behind me and went in, you. <laughs> you went and leave me alone. And I remember parking, and I was like, "Who the fuck is this?" Yeah, because what I wasn't in my car. Or what was I? No, you were in your uh, car. I just like yeah. never. I didn't think we were, I was gonna see you. That was pretty funny. I was so. I remember uh, Kevin was in the car, and I was yeah. just getting so mad. I'm like, "What is? He, I parked. What does he want me to do?" That's funny. I, yeah, it would have been better if I was in a different car. Uh huh. Oh, I would. <laughs> I don't. I don't know if I would have been more scared or more pissed. Like, would I have gotten yeah. out and been like, "What?" No, you'd have driven away. Probably. I, I the, would have like fake parked and then left. You would have drawn, uh, driven to like the cop shop. <laughs> I would have called the like. I'd yeah. be calling cops and nine one one. Please, <laughs> please help me. I'm like, what? I just want to say what's up to my friend who just came back so, from a but dispensary. I was, uh, <laughs> cut that out. <laughs> uh, I was so hyped on um, seeing you, though. Yeah. Yeah. Always. Always. Done. All right, let's go. We're done. We're <laughs> that's, that's the end of that's 20 season minutes. Three. In, season three. <laughs> done. <laughs> I don't even know. It's been so long. I don't even know what to. Okay, so the first yeah, thing I'm going to get into. Talk about? Jake yeah. Wooten Pro. Did we talk about that? No. See, I feel like we did. But I know we did. I just don't know if we, we talked about yeah, the show. Yeah, we did outside we of it. we got to be more it's current. Been so long. And we've posted like, I don't know if you noticed this week too, or that week I, that you were gone. You've been posting a lot. Thank you. I, I went nuts. I've seen that. Okay. The f- I want to talk about- I'm on the page right now. Like how far back should I go? I want to talk about stuff. the pizza video. Did I watch that one? Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I might have missed I that don't, one. There's and you're so gonna much have going to, on. Okay, keep going, keep going. Uh, hang on. And you're going to have to tell me the name U- Urethra. Urethra? No, I don't know the fucking name of the, the video. Oh, hang on. E- I think it's like E-T-H. Dystopia? No. No. Yeah, there's a lot in here, man. Holy smokes. Oh, Dystopia is funny, too. Dystopia is good. Um, fuck, you got to be getting close, though. Right? People are, are like freaking out oh, right now is, that they know no, the video. Slappy curve. Is this it? No. no, no, it'll say, it'll say the name of the video on it. They'll be like writing on it. Keep going, oh, keep going. Yeah, you posted a bunch. Yeah, some of those were long, and I didn't watch the whole thing. Yeah, there is there like is one, one I posted. There was All a right. really long one that I posted, and the video was super sick. All right, this is stunning audio. Listening to me scroll right there. Oh, uh, right here, Ethereum. What I, does that mean? Ethereum. Let's look it up. So, hmm. Hang on. Yeah, I didn't know how to pronounce that video. So I was stoked on this video. I just want to make sure I get the right uh, definition. Ethereum is a decentralized open source blockchain with smart contract functionality. That's right. That's what I thought it was. It's not an actual word. It's a Bitcoin. I think uh, Don has, my wife has some of those. Okay. I thought it was a Bitcoin thing because I heard- It's a blockchain thing. I heard that word Uh a few weeks later on a different podcast and I'm Uh like, oh, I think that's this video. Yeah. It's uh, like Bitcoin and Ethereum are the same blockchain technology. Okay, four chan. Uh, <laughs> <4chan. laughs> um, I didn't watch this. Yeah, this was like forty minutes. Cut, th- I didn't cut this out too. You didn't watch it I either. I didn't watch this at work. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. I cut that out. Yeah. Uh, I was like, oh, I gotta watch this at home on the TV. Uh-huh. I was like, because I love pizza. Yeah. I was hyped on seeing Vincent Malou. Yeah, dude, I had pizza so for dinner. Sick. 
I'm hungry right now. <laughs> um, so stoked and then kind of disappointed. Oh, no. Well, then I shouldn't watch it. No, watch it. Because the part's fucked up. It's that, did you see it all, them talking about the video? And they talk about Vincent's slam on the alley-oop 180 down Clipper? No, I missed that one. Dude, okay. So you didn't see the video. Did you see no, that clip I'm, at all when he I'm hit pl- his? I'm playing Aaron Monty this week. That's fine. I posted a shit ton. <laughs> uh, he hit his head Ooh. so hard. So he landed on Clipper. He landed the alley oop five zero. Okay. So like fakey. He's regular. Alley oop. He went like the hard way over to like switch five zero. Okay. Right. Does it? They want a photo. They're like, oh, can we get a photo? No. Next one. Yeah. Uh, sticks or like misses it, hits his head, hits his head to the point that the doctor said, like, if, if this was like half an inch or something, you'd be dead. You would have mm. been dead instantly. Mm. Like, it was such yeah, a dude. hard hit. The head is not meant for that kind it of damage. It was so gnarly. He so didn't like, have a, wait a second. He didn't have a helmet. He did not have a, none of these dudes had a helmet on. Oh, I can't watch this. But this, <laughs> but it's like all new pizza dudes. All right. This is also, there's a clip in here. Is Chase in this? Chase is not in this. And which I was going to ask you is Chase Ducky? still on pizza? What about Ducky? Ducky was in this. Okay. Dude, I've seen some of the Ducky stuff, so maybe that's what I saw. Did you see the Ducky where he lip slid and the bar broke? You didn't see that either. Mm. He lip slides no, I missed that. Uh, Hubba <laughs> okay. into a flat bar rail. Okay. The rail breaks entirely and yeah. he goes to his face. Oh my gosh. It w- doesn't he have like a big huge face like uh I think he already has that scar from that one that's round. what I'm saying yeah. from the previous one he yeah. has all messed this up this one and they face. like slow mode when the point after the <laughs> oh, rail broke where yeah. he hit and yeah. he kind of like scorpioned in uh, dude didn't if you haven't also, seen this video I would watch it didn't for sure. he also do something else on a broken rail where it hit him in the gut I think so. <laughs> what, I think what is that guy's like problem? I think that was Ryan Townley okay where he almost got it oh the, you're right you're yeah. right you're right um I would definitely watch it. Okay. I was just like... Uh, you know, I have it open now. It's in this... I have two of yours, like, in other windows. This drive or be driven... Oh, was drive another, or be driven was sick, too. It was another 20 minutes. I'm like, I, yeah. It, just at that moment, I couldn't watch it, so... That one has a lot... in another tab. ...of hippie jumps. Okay. Hippie jump 180s. I would... Yeah, I would definitely watch both right. of those. Um, So, I was kind of, like... I guess not disappointed. I was just, like, building it up too much that I was like... I can't even watch it now. I yeah. got to watch it later. Did it make you want to go buy some Ethereum? No, it made me want to buy some pizza. <laughs> uh, so the video was sick. All like new dudes on the team. Okay. Um, the thumbnail this, looks badass. That arched board oh, side. Oh, that board side is fucked. Yeah. Um, and that's Ducky right there. Nice. Um, from this, I just wanted to transition into this one that I was so hyped on watching. Which one? I hope I saw it. No, the pizza one oh, oh, oh. that I was like so ready to watch. Contrast two, I need to bring this up again because I it's changed again. What? And even Joe was like, "How many times have you seen this video? That video <laughs> that Devonte Jolly put out." Yeah. Right. Yes, I've only seen it the one time, but that was a really good one. Uh, what is it? What Illegal is it sieve. Uh, uh, Godspeed. Godspeed. Yeah. I have seen that full video twelve times. Oh my gosh, dude! That's twelve hours. That's twelve out, uh, like to the point where. Two songs came on, and mm-hmm. Joe's like, "You're watching this again," and I'm like, <laughs> "She's recognizing it." I legit, I think it might be my favorite video ever. I need to watch it again because I remember really enjoying it. It was everything, like the music, everything about that video. Ashad's in it, of course. Mm-hmm. Kevin White talking about like him in Copenhagen. Yeah. All right. That and this is what does it too. By like the twelfth time, Joe's like, "What is going on?" Mm-hmm. And I'm like, "Every literally every time autoplay." It plays that next. Oh, it knows you want it. I, I get because yeah. I've seen it, it so many times. You. So it plays it again, and I'm like, well, yeah. I'm not going to turn it off. It's like those movies sometimes that come on, and you're like, it doesn't matter where it starts, you're just going to in. For you're the, in for it. Yeah. Yeah. You're in it to, what is it? Fit in where you get in. In it to win it. Well, yeah, that's the other one. Yeah. Wait, wait, is that right? Fit in where you get, get in, in where, where you, you fit, fit in. in. There it, it is. Doesn't really make sense with the movie. That probably should be the name of the, uh, either oh, yeah. season three or get in where you fit in. Get in. Season get three. In. Get in where you fit in semicolon get in where you fit in <laughs> but um yeah i can't i you freaked out because i think i told you i saw it like three times yeah like, now you're up to 12 12 times to- i've seen uh, it so many times when i'm playing skater excel i like wearing the godspeed sweat pants yeah oh, those are pretty good and that song is good that mm-hmm. song in the beginning by frank ocean yeah the, everything about that is good i liked it yeah and of course what? the controversial back three 
We talked about it how many episodes ago. So now it's like uh, back in this, that came out on Christmas. Uh, Skate Toast episode season three sponsored by Godspeed <laughs> and Illegal <laughs> Sin. <laughs> oh, I'd love that'd be tight. Oh, right. Oh, did you? So, watch, yeah, I mean, um, all you to pick out the other ones. Yeah, the let's sit, see. Down, sit down. Sit down. Jankum again that, kills it. That was a little too silly for me. I sometimes I need that. Yeah. That was like like that. Uh, I mean, some of it was definitely funny. That guy impersonating Jason Dell. Yeah, I that's mean, funny. Was, that was. I mean, yeah, it was silly. Yeah. It was silly, but it was funny. Um, what else? Let me just scroll through and see. I posted a bunch of uh, Skater Excel clips. Yeah. Oh, dude. Um, John Worthington on Creature. Yeah, I, I think he's just on the squad. I don't think he's pro. He's just uh, he's just now. I think he's part. just on the yeah, team. Yeah, but yeah. oh my gosh, that guy fits Creature perfect. Yeah, for sure. That guy's so fun to watch. He's always like blowing glass, like making pipes that look mm-hmm. like trucks and look like bongs that look like skateboards yeah. and all kinds of crazy stuff. But then you see him shred. He's got such a way with his feet. It's like um, such a light touch. Yeah. Because when he gets up on a, any pool, it seems like he get he can get into anything. But some of the ones where he goes up around a hip into like a front smith, the way that he just creeps and crawls around the coping, uh-huh. it's so interesting the way that his feet work. Was it in this video that... I don't remember if it was this one or I think I'm getting it confused with Dystopia. Uh-huh. Um, Wasn't that it? Dystopia. That's him. Oh, was that the same video? No. Yeah, this is Tate Crew. I, I that just reminded me. Oh, oh, okay. Dystopia, that was Dystopia. Yeah, Dystopia is uh, John do, Worthington's part. Um, does he do Right here. Welcome. Well, at first they did a welcome to the horde. That was like his welcome, and then they put out his part. Well, I wonder which one I'm thinking yeah, of then. One, one Cuz I've two. seen both of those. Yeah. Um Right here, Dystopia. He carves He's in a pool mm-hmm. and he carves like carve, 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 and yeah, then carve yeah. under. And that I remember, was cool. I remember showing you an Instagram clip of him a long time ago when I started Whoa. when I started following him. I remember showing you one of those where I was like, "Dude, watch this guy double carve." Yeah, because it's like he goes up and under the filter and then back into a five zero. Yeah, yeah. I, I was it. telling you we were talking about it beforehand, and I was telling you like this was kind of a vert button for me. I know <laughs> where I was hitting it because it got like too pooly, and I'm like, oh, I don't really relate to it. But I remember. Mm-hmm. Seeing that and being like, wow, that was, yeah. and not even like, not even vert button, but I was definitely like at a certain point kind of checking out. Right. It was like, I don't know, that seven guy, minutes long. That guy was charging the whole time. I couldn't yeah. stop watching it. I've never, ever had a vert button. I watch yeah. vert only if I, if it was there. I mean, I've watched <laughs> you have a street ju- button. No, cause I love it all. Yeah. I might have like a, maybe a freestyle button. That's, like rapping or? No, no, no. Skateboard, like freestyle, like some of the. Stuff that goes on, like some of the Rodney Mullen stuff, or you know, or it's just like oh, freestyle. Oh, I got you that style. There's still a bunch of that going on. There's like the, the like Japanese kids killing it, like with the primo slides and all that, yeah. primo, like all that stuff. And you, eh. you could kind of say too, Andy Anderson. No, did you watch seen him? I didn't know. I didn't see that. <sighs> Andy Anderson, man. But it is, he has, he it can, is a little freestyle. No, no, no. He can do freestyle. Okay. But he can kill it on everything else too. Yeah, but and it's he not does... a freestyle video whatsoever. No, 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 but he does freestyle. He can, but that is not his shtick. I think he does like that's it's not the majority, but like he has free like his part compared to his stuff I doesn't shot. bother me at all because like, No, I'm not I'm saying just, it bothers me. Mm-hmm. I'm just saying like he's definitely more he's just freestyle than like Kevin White. So right? watch this video and you'll understand why, man. He's just a free spirit, man. He yeah. lives in a Well a, he definitely seems like a free spirit. He lives in like an ambulance, like a, yeah. a, a like a tiny house kind of thing and he just moves around and he's just friendly and like yeah. it's just so crazy. It's a really good video. That dystopia, yeah, that thumbnail mm. is that the tail slide, or yeah, is that the? That's up to tail. Slide. Okay, the ender. That whole thing is gnarly. That whatever that. I is, don't know how you skate that. You, it's I know it because you're getting into a wall ride that's not. Like, crap! It's oh, like shit. a, it's a very steep wall ride. Yeah, that and goes it's into like a curve. It's like curved out. Yeah, yeah uh, I don't even that. Know. It looks backside so fun. kickflip. Yes, the was kickflip so sick. And, and then you, when he went up and over it too. And you have that like sculpture in the middle where like if you're bailing. You're going right into that. That's thing. a crazy thing to skate. Yeah, and only I mean he's been putting parts out on that thing for a while. His Instagram clips. Uh huh. That's what I was gonna say. It's that same dude. Oh yeah, who same guy. Because sure. I don't. There's been no, a couple. Anyone of else pe- has been skating that? Uh, somebody did with him. I saw one th- one time. I think mm-hmm. carving around it, but he's just crushing it. I mean, to the yeah. point where in the seven minute video, that thing it was in it like four or five times. I think, and wasn't it? Was it all back to back to back? No, no, no. They were sparsed out. There was okay. A few, they, they, I thought it he, all of a sudden like, he came back to that. And it, it was at that spot. That was just, I think at the end though, it was like clip and then the kickflip. I'm sure there was a couple back to back, but not all of them. 
But yeah, he was there. And I think like the first one, he was just like showing him car. The stuff he does in pools, man. The way he goes and like backside Ollie over the stairs, like yeah. on a tiny little flat wall. Yeah. Oh, some of that that's stuff's so crazy. hard because it's so like switch tight carving and over them. Sw- yeah. yeah, his switch. I really envy switch carves. Yeah. You got a good switch carve, like it show oh, I saw a clip of Zion. Mm. I think I might have sent you it. I don't remember what park he was so. skating, but like fully like almost half the bowl. Mm. It's like it's a wide thing with like a bunch of different obstacles. It's at a park. Uh-huh. But like fully switch, switch carve. carving. God, it looks so good. It does look cool. Because you just know it's switch, and then it's like, oh, that's just so much harder. So much harder, <laughs> so yes. Because I already, I already think like car to be good at carving yeah. is a skill. Oh yeah, for sure. That's like a hard thing to master. Hunter has got a really good carve. Yeah, he does. When he does it, it at cream, mm-hmm. it sounds like a racetrack. Yeah, yeah. You hear like, whoo, whoo. yeah, yeah. We didn't even talk about any of the stuff last week because uh, I met you up in Oshkosh. We skated the park in the craziest wind. Yeah, that footage is so blown out with the wind; it's nuts. So, yeah, yeah, that was uh, a, that day. Sucked. I don't mind putting it out with the podcast video because I turned all that volume off. But like, if there was some clips I couldn't even post unless I just it was just music. Yeah, and Cole hit me up after and was like, "Were you guys skating?" And I'm like, "Dude, it it yeah. sucked." But I found this little like, curb at the bank when I was waiting for you. I don't know if you ever skate this one. Do you? Uh, not really. But we like you could do Manny to Manny off, or like I mean, there was like three or four different stalls. Uh huh. In this closed I think, bank, I think I've tried because there's like four of them. Mm-hmm. I think I've tried like maybe like Manny yeah. drop Manny like Manny a yeah. bunch of them, or even I think I tried ollieing all of them. Mm-hmm. But you get to a certain like third one, I'm like losing my speed. Yeah. That, that place, is interesting. Uh, I do never skate that. There was uh, so much salt from the snow. So like you, it oh, needs a broom sure. or an air or something. like. To Honestly, this was the only little section that really didn't have any. That spot too, in like where the cars come in for the bank, yeah. is always like really cruddy right yeah, there. Yeah, for sure. But de- that spot, probably the best spot in Oshkosh because it has like- down below, it has yeah, that ledge things. going in, and then up front, it has those banks. Yeah, like that spot's so fun. I don't think I posted any of those ones because well, we're we're saving them for the yeah for, for yeah, the secret we'll, video. We'll see. Yeah, we'll see. <laughs> but uh, I don't know. I kind of always feel weird when I'm just skating a street spot by myself. It feels weird as an old man. <laughs> yeah. Well, you but, always hit the because cur- even when we met up to do the other trick at the at the other bank, uh-huh. man, a lot of banks we yeah. skate. Bank, bank, bank. And the I, other spot that day was a bank. Uh, I don't feel union. so bad though when we're together. It's yeah. just when I'm just by myself, I just feel. But you were awkward. skating. I think that one too. When I tried, you know, that ollie up to whatever mm-hmm. at that one spot, you were skating curbs before I got there too. Yeah, I love a curb. Yeah, I love a good curb. That one spot though on the other ledge, I think I did put a clip. Maybe I didn't put it, but I did that like boneless to. Oh yeah, you posted boneless that. to tail. I don't think I don't see it here on the board. Like I might not have shared it over. Yeah, but it was like a boneless to tail kind of cavemany out. Mm-hmm. I'm doing a lot of that now. Yeah, all yeah, a lot of grabs. All nose grab caveman off the bonks. That's cool though. Um, yeah, there's so much going on, man. I was watching this. I one. know. I don't even know. And, I don't know what else. And to there's talk been past about. episodes where like we have said you can't go back, right? Yeah, you can't go back. So I don't even know where to begin. I wanted to talk about the pizza video. Um, that other one you didn't see that um, drive or be driven. Yeah, that I, one's, yeah, I, that start, one's I really just good. looked and it was only at the beginning because mm-hmm. I saw it was like a long one. I was like, oh, I'm going to save this here and watch it. And then it's just this tab that's open that I never got back to. Yeah, for sure. Uh, Rips, though, man, was killing it when we were skating last week at yeah. uh, Oshkosh. Man, I got this clip of him doing that that quarter pipe to bank to wall ride thing. He fly. I'm watching it right now. Look at this. Flying backside. Just a big ass ollie to wall ride, man. That's crazy. Yeah, he lands so solid on the wall, and he comes out of it so easy. It's the coming out that always trips me out. Like, mm-hmm. how do you come out of that? Because that one isn't the. It doesn't like gradually go into the bank. No, it's, it's a straight wall, ninety degrees. Yeah, I wonder what the degree is on the bank itself. Is that like maybe is that forty? Probably. I was gonna say forty five. It's yeah, probably something like that. But then to a ninety. Like it's, yeah, that's straight hard, into yeah, the wall. That's a harsh yeah. bank right there to go up it. But I mean, some people just do wall rides so easy. Yeah. You see that one guy? I forget his actual Holy name. Holy shit! Yeah, you saw that. Okay, like, you uh, are me I this am. episode. Well, it's a whole new, whole new setup. I'm trying the mics in a new place, and I've got this cable is is got to shorten it. So every time I touch it, it kind of goes out. But you're right. I am playing you today. <laughs> Hi, I'm Aaron Monty. But yeah, I posted this clip of a snowboarder. Do, going off of the roof of a building, 
down some sort of what is that pole? It's like part of the architecture. I don't it's even a, know. It's, it's a huge, so gnarly, huge uh, boards. So he's trying to go like, like how high? He's trying to go back lip to fakie. How right? high do you think that roof is, though? It's huge. It's got to be like twenty foot, at least twenty. Probably at least twenty. At feet. least twenty feet. At least he's got all that snow at the bottom. But he uh-huh. does a fifty. I mean, on a on a snowboard. But he's That's trying to go. So he's gnarly. He's trying to go two seventy back lip to fakie. That's what he's trying, and he does it finally at the end. I think That's this is it right here. Oh, so gnarly! Front side two seventy. The board or to four, yeah, board to forward actually. So it's a front side. So That's gnarly. crazy. That's crazy. Down. Every every time I, I see clips, if I wasn't who such, is this guy? Seb Picard. If I wasn't such a wimp about the cold, yeah. <laughs> snowboarding looks so fun. Oh yeah. When you see like it's fun, man. It's I've done it a few seasons. But. When you see like. The street snowboarding and they're hitting like yeah. gnarly rails. Yeah, in the streets. It looks <laughs> that looks so fun to me because of the snow factor. Yeah, but you can get seriously broke off with your feet still hanging into your board. Yeah, stuck you can to your still feet. get broke off. Oh, yeah. But am I I'd be more willing to try a kinked rail on, on a, a snowboard, snowboard I would than too. on a skateboard. I would too. I mean I've gone down rails on my snowboard on a, on a hill, like it's sunburst. Uh-huh. It's not a mega hill, but there was definitely a curved rail that I was like, oh, I can, I'll hit that all day. Yeah, And you'd like, knowing snowboarding and the it's board just being on you. Because you're not relying on a good pop. Yeah. You're just jumping. Yeah. And you're sliding and you're and jumping. That's, and that's how you fucking sack in skateboarding. Yeah. You don't have you a good mean, pop, you're yeah. getting fucked. For real. But yeah, so this is awesome. So Seb Picard, it says right here, is Seb Picard made of rubber? Because <laughs> he got he got bodied he got, a bunch. Uh, hit it, who went back and hit his head? Yeah. I mean, snow is snow, but it's still going to hurt. Spe- when you're jumping Gosh. off like a 50-foot building. Yeah. What about me with my uh, uh, my Manny? Yeah, you were going to say Ollie Manny. But it wasn't. It was a roll-up yeah. <laughs> roll Manny. <laughs> but <laughs> I but you did. you held, <laughs> I you wanted did. to. I did. That might I was I titled this one my longest intentional Manny. Yeah. Because I've accidentally done a few. I don't still don't think that long. I think you accidentally have done, only have done one. Yeah, probably on that little Manny pad mm-hmm. at Cream. I didn't mean to. You but just I went tried all to alley up, but you, yeah, you yeah. Manny the whole thing. <laughs> but that thing is like maybe six feet. Seven and this feet. is honestly That's too a ten foot. Ten foot Manny. This is like what we had to get into because everything else was so hard to skate. Yeah, it was so windy. Like the bank kind of sucked. Yeah. That was fun though. Yeah, I'm. I'm gonna make a rule, Ooh, okay. and I I made this already with. For me, it needs to be above forty. Deg- every year it goes up. It yeah. needs to be above forty degrees for me to skate outside. If the wind is eighteen to twenty, yeah, that's too much. Not worth it. Not worth it. That's why we got to go indoor at that point. Yeah, yeah. Let's let uh, let's call this like a. Let's start. Let's see if we can pull off a skatosis meetup. What do you mean? Let's see if the listeners will try oh. try to find us at the Dew Tour in Des Moines. Yeah. It's, uh, let me just make sure the actual weekend. It's the 20th, 23rd? I think, it, mm, you uh, might be right, 20, 23rd. Right here, yeah, 20 to 23rd of May yeah. in Des Moines at the very brand new uh, Lauridson. Lauridson? The new, Lor- It's I guess it's new Lauridson uh, skate park. Look at me touching this thing. It's like right... <laughs> Touching it while I try not to touch it. Yeah, not so easy. No, it's is right it? under where the track pad is. I guess I got to get a better sitch. A lot of excuses. Uh, so that'd be tight if Max was there because his parents live there. Well, let's just get everybody there that we yeah. know. I mean, as many as we can. I mean, that park looks amazing. It's huge. So many different things to skate. It's can't it's wait. like the whole like lakefront. Uh, I think like it's it, a river. Riverfront. It stretches so long. Yeah. Um. I'm looking forward to checking that out. Yeah. I would love to have. Uh, Skatosis listeners meet us up there. Yeah, that'd be tight. I think I want to try to uh, stay for the whole weekend. Like, get out. We there still got to get you Friday gotta, to Sunday. You got to get vaccinated, and we got to get to BC. <laughs> okay, because that's I think that's the only way you're going to get in. <laughs> <laughs> They're not like making you be vaccinated to travel. Uh, that, that's a little, no. That's you a can, little much. But you wouldn't. I don't believe you have to get the test. The because th- like test is different than a vaccine. I'm no, not I like, know. I'm not like anti-vaccine, but I'm definitely not running out for it. Yeah, mm, I was. I, uh, know. I, know. <laughs> <laughs> I got like l- luckily I got on through work when right. phase two when teachers got it. Yeah, I'm. I mean, if it comes, if it becomes available, eh, I'll think about it. But I'm not like looking for it because I know they were talking about vaccinated passports. Yeah, that's a little much, man. Yeah, but if you. 
Joe just went to Hawaii mm-hmm. and you have to get and every like if we were going to BC to see um I wanted to say Jason, not Jason. Um Scott. Scott. Mm-hmm. Uh she had to get a test 72 hours beforehand and had to be negative. That's so understandable. That you don't have to be quarantined. Sure. But I would imagine if you have the vaccine. It's still, they're still going to want you to test. Doesn't mean you're not carrying it just because you're vaccinated. Doesn't mean you're not. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. You're that's right. That's what I'm saying. So it really is this. It really is like a horse of pee. Like you could go either way. You have to do the test. Yeah. And then plus you probably got a placebo. <laughs> <laughs> we'll we'll see tonight. We'll see tonight. Wait if I get second, if dude. I get fucked up tonight. Hang on. Did you ask your doctor? I didn't whoever, go to the doctor. Whoever gave you this shot, did you read any fine print that this does anything to cure skatosis? Oh what? I didn't I did read the paperwork and You're I You're scaring me here. <laughs> the words were not in there. If Ugh. maybe it was like Ew. small print. Yeah. I you think didn't I'm really charged that hard today. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it! This wacky vacky is getting me. I don't know, man. Oh, yeah, you're making me nervous. Oh, damn. Yeah. Mm. And I didn't really like the pizza video. Oh, oh man. shit! <laughs> shit! What have I done? <laughs> Season three is the end of it all. Oh my! I got to start God. doing the show by myself. Oh, get man. vaccinated. Get out. Oh, forget it. What does it fit in? Get in where you fit in. <laughs> what is fit in? The get third in. time. What is it? <laughs> get in where you fit in. Oh man, season three. All right. Well, yeah, I don't know what else to talk about at this point because there's, yeah, we, there's too many things to talk I, about. I think this is a perfect time to I end it. I had a great time today. I had fun skateboarding with you. I know Hell you yeah, want to hit the road in a little bit. I, we got Skater XL to play. I know. There's beer to drink. Yeah, I dog. Mean, come on. This is a podcast. Get out of here. Go, go uh, everybody. I'm going to do like the gro- Grasso thing. Just turn this computer off, whatever you're listening to, or keep it in your ear and go skate. <laughs> yeah, get out there and skate. <laughs> yeah, dude. All right, man. Well, welcome yeah. to season three. Cheers. Love you, bro. Love you, dog. All right. Thanks for uh, getting vaccinated, I guess. <laughs> Peace. Peace. Go skate.